Hello everybody, it's me again, and welcome back to Five Nights at Freddy's 4, part number two. I want to apologize for the length of last part. I gave myself a grand total of an hour to record a new, to record a first session for you guys, but by the time I worked out all the technical difficulties I was having, I had about 20 minutes, maybe. So, yeah, sorry about that. But this, this is going to be a full-length episode, so really the first official episode of Five Nights at Freddy's 4, which is going to be more than just one freaking attempt. Um... It was kind of good, by the way, because I actually was able to figure out the kinks of the game a little bit better, thanks to some of you guys who left comments. Um, uh, yeah, there's basically, for three games, we're trained to not look too long at things, and in this game, you have to stare them out with the flashlight. Because it's not so much the flashlight that scares them away, it's the fact that they're being looked at. You know, and it's sort of like Foxy, you know? You look at him and he won't move. Pretty much that's what you have to do. So when I was turning around and seeing the little demon Freddies, and first there was one, then there was two, it's because I wasn't watching them long enough. And it, it was building power until eventually I turned around and then there was real Freddy and he freaking murdered me to death. So yeah, basically the flashlight is my only line of defense because it scares them away, you know. So that's basically it. And also apparently the whispers are really, really freaking hard to hear. <laughs> So, I'm really gonna have to listen. But there's one thing that confuses me um, about the lore of this story that I started thinking about after I was done. Um, we already saw this. What did you do this time? He locked you in your room again. Don't be scared. I'm here with you. Yeah. Um, basically, we're playing as a little boy, is what this is implying here. Which confuses me because the whole premise of this game is that children, five children were murdered and stuffed into suits and they their spirits inhabited the animatronics and now they're out for vengeance why would they be out for vengeance against a little boy what did this little boy ever do to them because i thought they were after some you know former employee you know um, you know people think it's phone guy but that's not exactly confirmed uh, tomorrow's another day yeah so why are they after this little boy maybe it's because his parents are a certain someone <gasps> maybe like, I don't know about you, but it seems like these little things were sold at auction. So, why on earth would you ever freaking buy stuff from a haunted animatronic place? Like, I'm sorry, but that just seems freaking stupid. And I know how to play, but... So, I'm really gonna have to freaking listen. Yeah, and also I noticed the desk fan. Oh, and this. And <coughs> squeak. <coughs> Squeak. Yay, I found the squeaker. Well, I didn't find the squeaker. I read it online. Yeah. But apparently the breathing is, like, super subtle and really hard to hear. And I've never heard it. So I don't exactly know what it sounds like. So if I turn around and I see the Demon Freddies, I have to keep the light on until they go away. That's how that works. I thought it was because it was getting angry that I was looking too long. Because, hey, except for Foxy, that's how the rest of the games worked. So, fuck. And also, this game feels very different than the others, obviously, because it is very different. But, like, you know, the whole basis was watching scary things through a camera. And now there's no camera while you're an employee at some security location. But there is no security location. That's my alarm going off. Because <laughs> I got up extra early for you guys. Okay. This is the fucking worst. All right, I'm already feeling it again. It was like, I hop back into it and I'm like, hooray, and more Five Nights at Freddy's, yay, I get to play some more today after the kind of failure of an episode yesterday. And I'm already like, why the fuck do I do this to myself? Alright, so far haven't seen Diddly Squat, but I like how they brought back the fan. <laughs> I was wondering how they were going to incorporate Phone Guy, but he didn't even bother. Phone Guy's like not even a thing. Did I see something at the end of the hallway, or am I just getting paranoid? I'm probably getting paranoid. So I'm thinking that maybe the guy who murdered the children had his own kid. And they're like, fuck you, you have his blood, so that's good enough for me. I've never heard the breathing, so I don't know what it sounds like. Yeah, go away, bitch. Okay. Yeah, they don't scare me so much anymore. Already. I haven't checked Foxy in a long time. Was that what that was? I heard something! Fuck. How long 
do I hold this? I need to check Freddy! Otherwise he's gonna get me! I'm going. Fuck. Oh! Oh my god, I did it! Oh my god, I did it! Woo! First try on the second day! Hooray! I mean my second day, first day of the game, but you get it. Holy crap! Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Was that breathing I heard? I still don't know, but I heard a freaky noise and I played it safe. Four days till the party, okay. So same thing. Let me got my wires all over Keith. Okay. You know he's hiding again? Who's hiding again? Me? Or is that the bear talking to me? He won't stop until you find him. Find who? The puppet? Well, I'm still crying, so I assume that means I'm still locked in my room over there? Well, that's not exactly, you know, not exactly helpful. These are my friends. But see, like, the room that I'm in, in the game, is... has two doors and a closet. This one looks like it only has one door. And a desk and a bed. So, like, is this can't be the same room. So maybe... But it looks like I'm in a child's room. Oh my god. I'm not locked in my room. Hi there. How are you? So... This way. Hi. So this is my house. That's so creepy. The little Golden Freddy one is following me around. I assume that's maybe upstairs? I don't know. But whatever it is, I can't go up there. And I can't go this way. Hi! I like how it automatically hides my mouse in the scene so it's not sitting in the middle of my screen when I forget to move it. So props to you, developer. Oh. What the hell is... Is that the mangle? Still in pieces? It looks like my sister tore it apart. Sister, because everything's pink. I mean, that seems to be what it suggests. What is that? That's like my squid hat, except creepy. I guess I'm just... Looking for something. I assume that's what I was looking for. You won't stop until you find him. I can't click on anything because I can't see my freaking mouse. So what's going on here? Hi. What am I ah! Okay. Fuck you, you asshole. There's Foxy's missing head. Good God. Tomorrow is another day. First jump scare of the day, and it's in a freaking 8-bit game. Fun with... What? Hold control to use flashlight. Use flashlight to stop, plush trap... What? I didn't get to read the last part. Wait, what the fuck is this? Excuse me, what the hell is this? What the hell is this? I don't- I can't see my mouse, all I have is my flashlight. You fucking asshole piece of shit. Little bunny plush trap went hopping through my house. Got a little too close to me and ate my face off. Yay. What the fuck? Fuck this. This is creepy. I didn't even get to read the last part of the tip. So I have no freaking clue what I'm doing. Hi there. Stop fucking staring at me. I assume I'm supposed to be keeping him away for the next seven seconds. Seis, cinco, cuatro, tres, dos, uno, cero. Too bad. Too bad what? I thought I was doing okay. I just thought I had to keep him away from me. Okay. I don't know the premise of that, but that was weird. All right, night two. There's a plushy spring trap. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Why would there be a plushy spring trap if nobody had ever heard of it? Like, it was locked in a back room for 20, 30 years until Freddy Fazbear's Pizza wasn't even a thing anymore. So what the fuck? That's the clock going off. Just go ahead and check behind me. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck you, I heard that. <gasps> Alright! Yep, that was Bonnie. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> oh fuck, I should have shut the door. Okay, go back to the door. Shut it. Shut it. That is definitely breathing. I heard that. Fuck off, chicken. I assume that's what that is because I saw Chica in the door last time, but fuck. Okay, I think I'm good. Time to let's check behind me real quick. Wow! Okay, there's almost three. Or was that just a reflection of Chica's eye? It might have been a reflection, but it freaked me out. Fuck off, Bonnie! Nobody likes you! It's that moment of hesitation. Is like, is there something is something gonna be there? Did I mess up? Was there breathing and did I not just hear it? Am I about to die? That's in the kitchen. That's Chica. What was that? Chica, I freaking see you. Eh. They're getting pretty angry right now. Okay, over here. Okay. This is one of those games where, like, the ultimate stress doesn't make me want to freak out and start spouting nonsense. It just makes me want to shut my mouth. Go away. You're, like, the easiest part of this. Okay. Go! I keep seeing them down the hall and it's freaky! I just heard something on the on the left, 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 left. Stop it! God, they're both like right here. Okay. I heard that. That was a breath! That was a breath! That was a breath! It literally sounds like someone breathing into a microphone without a filter. Like mine. <laughs> okay, I think that means he left. Check behind me. Bleh. Yeah. And I think I heard something over here. Nothing. Okay, I need to I need to check on Foxy. It's been too long. Nothing? Okay. Over here. Fuck off, Chica! Behind me! Uh, 5 a.m. Okay. Come on, I can do it! I can do it! I can try! Yes! Oh! First try on night two! Oh yes! I'm so good! days until the party. I assume it's gonna get a whole lot harder. Oh my god. Well then, that looks terrifying. He left without you. He knows that you hate it here. You are right beside the exit. If you run, you can make it. What? I can't do anything. Hurry, run toward the exit. No, don't you remember what you saw? The exit is the other way. Hurry and leave. Okay. Who's talking to me? I assume that's my- Ah! It's too late. Hurry the other way and find someone who will help. You know what will happen if he catches you. Okay, he's inside the suit. Look at that. You can find help if you can get past them. You have to be strong. Oh, God. No! Wait. Tomorrow is another day. Hold on a minute. Could these stop plush up on the X to skip two hours on the next night? Oh, so I have to actually let him come towards me. 
That's freaking scary. Okay, but, um, you telling me that, uh, these are, these could be different kids? Okay. Don't. Okay. La, 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 la. Okay, yeah, I'm not doing this. Too bad. Oh, well. I tried. I kind of saw him move. Sort of. You really got to not look at him for a long time. That is so freaking scary. Okay. Maybe I'll get it next time. Who knows? Night three. All right. I have a feeling this one is not going to go as well. <gasps> right off the bat. <coughs> what the hell? I'm hearing things run left, right, left, right. There's nothing. Left. Left. That wasn't Bonnie. That's Foxy. That's why he's running around so much. So he can come from either side? He knows when I check and he runs to the other side. Flashlight's flickering. I assume that means Freddy's getting angry. Yeah. Over here. And Chick is in the kitchen. Stop it! Okay, that is really freaking me out, dude. God damn it. Stop! Okay, now that was Bonnie. Not good. Not good. A little too much to worry about now. Eh. God damn it, that is so foxy. And now is that Bonnie over there? That was like right in my ear and that was scary. Okay. Check over here. Fuck off, Chica. Fuck off all of you! Ugh. Their footsteps are creepy. It's like fee fi fo fuck you. Nothing? Yet? I almost hit control. Just out of, like, habit. Yeah, it's just that one... <sighs> It doesn't exactly even sound like breathing, but it's totally a <sighs> and it's scary. Can I leave now? I think I can leave now. I probably can't, but I think I can leave now. Okay, Freddy's getting mad. Freddy's getting mad. <laughs> okay. Maybe if I don't check the closet often enough, Foxy will think that's a safe place to hide. Eh. And, uh... He'll go and hide in there and be right in front of me for the rest of all eternity. Sounds sounds like a plan. <sighs> it's Bonnie again! God damn it. Nah. Eh. Okay. Check behind me. Eh. I heard that on the left. Okay. That was a breath. That was a breath. Very, very quietly. But that was a breath. This is so creepy. Can I go now? I have to go now. 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 Eh. Let's check over here. I think that was a breath, but I'm not sure. Okay, 
okay, okay, okay. I took a risk there. Because <laughs> I wasn't sure what the fuck I was doing. Freddy? Lel. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Chica's in the kitchen. Classic. Just like always. Bonnie on the left, Chica on the right. Except this time, Foxy don't follow no rules. He can go wherever the fuck he wants. Bleh. Come on. Come on, 5 a.m. That was a breath if ever I heard one. Oh my god! Is it because I'm just so freaking amazing? Or is this game too easy? Now that I know what I'm doing, I haven't been killed. All right then. You know, the point of this series is supposed to be like, create a hard game that'll scare me so I can give a good reaction to my viewers, but... <laughs> I'm not gonna lose on purpose. He hates me? Why? You have to get up. I'm so scared. Am I an autonotomophobic child? You can get out this time, but you have to hurry. Okay, exit is- oops, this way. You god. Okay, you have the spring trap plushie. Where is your plush toy? Mine is spring bonnie. <laughs> no, it's not. Well, spring bonnie, okay. My daddy says I have to be careful with him or I will pinch my finger. He's a finger trap, he says. Why would you give a kid something that can... Well, I guess... 90s and 80s. Oh, I miss the days when they made toys that could kill a kid. Uh, what? Oh, that's where I came out. Okay. Well, I see you back there. If you try to scare me, it's not gonna freaking... Oh, I see. Okay. Hi! You better watch out. I hear they come to life at night. Or <laughs> you wouldn't be wrong. And if you die, they hide your body and never tell anyone. Why do you look so worried? See you at the party! Ha 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 ha! Ha, this kid has reason to be afraid. Okay. It's so, like, Golden Freddy plushie, I just assume that's like my favorite. You're laughing? Aren't you the kid who always hides under the table and cries? Ha ha ha! No one else is scared, why are you? Stop being such a baby. I hope they, I hope they kill you first. Just, you know, FYI. That is some creepy ambience in the background. How long have I been going, anyway? Um, hold on. Well, I have a moment. Actually, yeah, it's time for me to stop. Alright. Hey, buddy. Are you going to the party? Everyone is going to the party. Oh, wait, you have to go. It's your birthday. Ha ha. I figured it was my birthday. I remember that minigame. Uh. In the second game. Which was supposed to be, like, Fred Bear's Family Diner or something like that. And, um. Maybe that's why there's a spring plushie. Because the spring bonnie was actually being used in effect more as a mascot than an animatronic, I think? Um, at Fredbear's, right? I think? So, maybe this is, maybe this is, like, prequel, like, way back, where everything started. <gasps> that would be interesting, and I'm, maybe I'm the puppet, that's why I'm always crying. I'm, I'm gonna die at my own birthday party. Because I remember that mini game where you, I'm home, okay. Careful. Why? But anyway, um, what was I saying? Right, that mini game where there's all the kids uh, playing around inside with the mascots, and then there's one outside crying. Maybe he was outside crying because he was scared, and he left, and he's like, "Oh my god!" You know, like he's he's terrified because he hears what these things are doing, and then some purple guy pulls up in a car and murders him. Maybe that's this kid. Oh god, I'm gonna die, I think. Let's try going this way. There's the mango pieces all messed up again. I can't interact with anything in here. The fact that you watched me is really fucking creepy. And there was- and the Golden Freddy suit was in effect- ah! God damn it! Stop it! <sighs> He's scaring me on purpose! Is that an older brother or my dad or something? My dad is the murderer. Who knows? But tomorrow is another day. Alright. I'm not gonna start the next night because, um, I have to do plush Bonnie too. God damn it. Alright, let's go ahead and do plush Bonnie. Uh, plush trap, real quick. Yeah, okay. Uh, control is still flashlight. So, uh, what was I saying? I completely forget. When I get jump scared, it, you know, shit happens. Okay.
God damn it, I always get him just as he's moving. Ha! Huh. God damn it. Looks like it gives me less time to do it, too. Maybe. Uh, okay. <gasps> Fuck! My life! I can't do it! That's too scary! <laughs> Alright, that's it. I'm gonna end this episode right here, you guys. Before we just hop into night four. Heck yeah. Uh, I hope you guys are enjoying Five Nights at Freddy's 4. Sorry I'm not dying so much, but I have a feeling that's about to change as the way Night 4 went last time. Uh, like and favorite if you are, subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Farewell, friends. <laughs>